evening and welcome to the Goblin. I am your hostess Grigma. How's everyone doing tonight? Ooh, pardon me. <laughs> I'm doing well. I just uh, scarfed down a bunch of cookies. <laughs> Apologies. Um, yeah. Uh, sorry for last night's technical difficulties. What happened was uh, apparently our routers are trying to die. And uh, the router upstairs went out first. And my laptop can only connect to that router. But the PC can connect to the downstairs one as well. Um, and then the downstairs one went out. <laughs> so, um, yeah. I, I had weird internet problems last night. <laughs> because I... I watch stream manager for the stream on my laptop and I watch and I do the gaming and actual streaming from my PC and the laptop went out, but I was somehow still streaming. So I didn't think it was the internet. I thought something had gone awry with Twitch or something and yeah, I was, I was just confounded as to what was going on. And then after a little bit, I realized I wasn't streaming anymore because I was using Stream Manager on my phone. And suddenly I was offline. It's like, well, it's 1130. I'm exhausted. I'm not going to fuck with this tonight. <laughs> the router's in our bedroom. My husband was asleep. And yeah, I just was not down for that level of shenanigans last night. I was very tired. So today, hopefully, uh, we we rebooted the routers right before stream. So hopefully they're fresh and ready to go uh, and don't die on us. We've got, we've got new ones on order. So by Friday, we should have a whole new setup. And... Be in better condition but yeah so today was a bit milder but it takes me a lot to recover from big social events now it's weird i used to be not not exactly a social butterfly but i used to be able to handle crowds and being out and about and in loud situations much easier than I can now. And today, I mean, I had to drop my kid off at her homeschooling group and be in a park with kids and interact with people. And I got home from that and I did what I had to do to get school school ready for the week and I just sat afterwards and stared for a little while I, I just stared at my monitor and I tried to watch a couple streamers and they were just too much for me and it was it was weird it was just I I was overtaxed <laughs> and then I had to go pick her up again and On a, in a conversation with another mom for a while, which was more social interaction. And I am, I am crispy. <laughs> I, I have not had, I, I, after, after we picked my daughter up, she went over to my mom's and I uh, got to just sit and watch it, watch a streamer for a while and chill and turn my brain off to a degree and eat lunch and it was what I needed and I, I mean I am feeling a lot better right now but we are going to do a chill stream because I am still a little on the crispy end so we're going to decorate some uh some homesteads uh we've got Lakeview we're we're doing the bare bones right now to get it up and functional 
because we built it as kind of a wizard's tower. Usually, usually it's where I move my family to from Tundra Homestead, but this time I was convinced to make use of the enchanting tower and the alchemy tower. And I was going to put a library in, but kitchen's, al uh, kitchen's alchemy. So, and I really love the kitchen at uh, Lakeview. So we've, we've pretty much already kitted out the kitchen because it's, it's my happy place in Lakeview. <laughs> so we've got that situated. Um, we're working on building the arcane enchanter and the alchemy uh, doohickey, <laughs> alchemy lab, uh, because those are kind of important to having an enchanting tower and an alchemy tower. Um, so we're going to have to do some shopping for those. I don't know where to get gold bars. I have to figure that out. Um, I'm assuming, excuse me, one of the merchants will have such things. Um, it may be a smelting situation. I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, so that's, that's the one thing I know that we're, is outstanding that we're going to have to go digging for. Um, we haven't looked at the alchemy lab because that's, that's when my, my, uh, my streaming situation crashed was when we were just looking at the arcane enchanter to figure out what we needed. So we have to look at the alchemy lab, figure out what we need for that. Um, yeah. And then just basic furnishing of the house, uh, from there. So let us, let us build, let us craft, let us have a nice chill stream because it's, it's been a weekend and I, I can use some chill. <laughs> Hopefully you can too. Come along with me on this journey. Let's get my headset back on, put the game audio on, get us to the right stream, screen. Close OBS. <laughs> That's not helpful. Um, open the game. There we go. Click on the right icon. And your stream will go far. <laughs> ah! Oh yeah, we, uh, we decked out the, uh, I think this is the enchanting tower. Honor to you, my fane. Honor to you, my steward. Okay. So, okay, we're we're weighed down and there's a goat in the way. Move your ass. Okay. Oh, Jesus. You're coming up the stairs. Raya, everybody. Oh, and you're stuck. I am your sword and your shield. I am going Honor to, to start again, my fane. smacking people. Out of the way, guys. Okay, so, yeah. We decked out the enchanting tower because, I mean, it was there. I had the materials. So what have we got left? We've got a chest. We need nails and iron fittings for. We got nails and nails. We just need nails. And iron fittings. I think we may be out of iron ingots, though. So we may be doing another ingot run. But before we do, so iron ingots. We don't need straw. We're good on straw right now. Sure. Um, so iron ingots and let's see what we need for the alchemy tower. Oh yeah, we've got this, uh, this room where we can build an anvil. Oh, and we've got the basement where we can do our forge. So let's find out what we need for the forge, too. Let's see. Bunch of stuff. That. 
misc is what we're looking for. Alchemy lab. Quicksilver ingot, which I think we have. Um, oh, I may only have one quicksilver ingot. Oh. Do we need a quicksilver ingot for the enchanting lab, too? Okay. Ooh, we're low on gold. <laughs> we may have to go to Golden Hills and uh, pick up some cash. Maybe shake down the wife for some uh, as well. Oh yeah, I need goat horns. We've got some. Okay. And of course, all of the creatures we need to mount. That sounds terrible. Okay. If we have a quicksilver ingot already, we can just build that. Um, must we need pots? Nails. Okay. So we need a bunch of nails. We need iron fittings. We need quicksilver ingot. Going very slowly through the house. Feels so much less homey. It's weird. This is this is usually my home in the game. So kidding it out as a wizard's tower feels I don't wanna say sterile, but at least as it is now, it it does not feel like home. It feels it feels like a workplace. I don't have the kids running around. It, it's doesn't feel right. Okay, so we've got more goat horns. We've got corundum. Uh, I don't see... Where did... Uh -uh. Oh, let's, let's look in my misc. I don't see the fancy ingots anywhere. Did I leave them someplace? If we build a smelter, we've got a bunch of iron ingots. I think we need iron ingots to build the smelter. So, catch 22. Um. What do we need to build a smelter? Six clay, two iron fittings. Oh, we've got We've got clay. I'm going to build the smelter in the basement. Just because I like having that that forge set up down there. Although I joke, a, I joke a lot about having the forge set up down in the basement because it does not seem like a great idea to have it in a non-ventilated area. Okay. Let's go build us a smelter. And then we're gonna have to figure out where we hid. Quick, oh, haha, Hilda, do you have my quicksilver ingot? She does. Okay, we can build. We can build the alchemy lab.
Okay. So, I'm getting scattered here. So we're going to need another Quicksilver ingot. We need a gold ingot. <clears throat> need to stop saying the word ingot. <laughs> okay. It's Alchemy Lab. Yes. Okay. And before we do anything else, we're gonna go to the cellar. And we're going to see. Yes. Smelter. Yes. Armor's workbench. Sure. Rhinestone. Yes. How about an anvil? I don't see an anvil anywhere. <laughs> blacksmith's oh, blacksmith's forge. Uh we need more stone. Go upstairs and get stone. Oh, do you have stone? <laughs> Did I hand you stone? No. Damn it. Okay. We have to go back upstairs and get stone. But, before we do, let's use the smelter. Smelt us some more. a little bare bones in here, but it'll liven up. I got do, 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 do. iron ingots. I thought I was carrying much more iron ore than that. chest upstairs. Shit. Yeah. Bury it down. Yes. Okay. It's two gold ore. I may have to find a gold mine. Okay. The worst part about all of this is just how slowly you move. <laughs> because in order to build things, you have to carry things. And I, I just don't have the strength to move quickly while doing so. I mean, I could hand it all to Hilda and then take it back as I need it, but that process is just such a pain. Yes, I'd rather take a slow stroll. <laughs> okay. Shit, what was I doing? I was... Uh, I need stone to build the forge. Get some stone to build the forge. We'll build the forge. Okay, we'll build the forge. Then we'll go shopping. Okay. <laughs> so, for those of you who are new to the stream, I have ADHD in a big way. Um, <laughs> and by the time I stream in the evening, my Ritalin is a distant memory. So, keeping a train of thought while trying to do complex things 
isn't a happening thing here. <laughs> so if I seem a bit scattered, I am. And I make no apologies. Well, I make several apologies usually because I, I'm that type of person. But honestly, you get what you pay for. <laughs> This is this is why some people come to my stream. It, it's it's not a bug, it's a feature. Oh, do I have butter churn? At this place? I think you get a butter churn. And I think I made it work. Excuse me. Blacksmith's forge. Weed barrels. Hell yes. <laughs> okay, we're getting distracted. But we have mead now, so life is good. Okay, we've got a blacksmith's forge in the house. So we can stop running outside to uh, make nails and shit. <laughs> okay. Got a workbench, got a forge. Got smoke lingering up at the uh, underside of my house. Yeah, that was a that was a great thing to build. Let's see. Is there anything else in the basement? The aquarium. I do love having the aquarium. Painters. Weapon racks. Armor mannequin. I love armor mannequins. I love decking them out. Okay. We've got a tanning rack, so I'm not, like, freaking out about that. Shrine base. Having a shrine in the house is always a good thing. Having multiple shrines in the house is a great thing. Um, so then you get to customize a bit. But shrines are usually expensive as hell to make. Okay, we are going to go out. We're going to drop our stuff in the chest. Actually, you know what? Since we're working on the inside of the house at this point, we're gonna drop our stuff in this chest. So we don't have to keep running outside. Figure out the shit. Here we go. We're gonna start play this. Ingots. On nails. Stone. Okay, that does not take us down as light as I would like to be, so we are also going to store... here. I'm gonna store some food, because I'm pretty sure... oh, hey. <laughs> I'm running again! Yay! I feel like I'm moving so fast. Holy shit. Okay. Covered. You are getting food. Here we go. Anything that is not cooked goes in this cupboard. Also wine. Uh, oh, fresh meat is a plot thing. <laughs> we have 14 jugs of milk. No wonder we're weighed down. Holy shit. Um, that's raw potatoes. We won't say that aloud for fear we will summon my daughter. Um, <laughs> she loves rabbits very much. Um, let's see. What else can we drop? Oh, we do have a butter churn. I don't have enough milk. But we can use it. <laughs> that was not always true. 
We have a working butter churn. That is fantastic. We also have several jugs of milk. So, rock on. Um, let's see. We need gold, quicksilver, and iron ingots. Probably some more go towards too. Um, where do we want to start? Huh. I'm trying to remember the last place we went shopping. I think it was Fogwreath. Let's go to Riverwood first. Then we'll go to White Run. Then we'll go to Fogwreath. And if we're still out of luck on that, uh, we'll take a cab up to Solitude. Because we haven't been there yet, and the shopping's really good there. So let's stop at the blacksmith's first. Damn it. He is not around. Curious. What time is it? Is it like, it's either very early morning or twilight. It seems like people should be up. Traders open. Hope for stuff here. Hello, my brother-in-law. Thank you so much for taking care of those thieves. The Riverwood Trader is back to the way it used to be. Probably shouldn't leave you money lying on your counter. We're the only people around who aren't complete fools. It's true. Maybe oh, for a bit sale. Of this and a bit of oh, I've got stuff I can sell him too. <laughs> Let us sell him. Let's start by selling him things. Because I'm carrying around like 14 black mage robes. Sell. Yes. There we go. Okay. That cleaned him out. All right. We can sell him this. Okay. Uh, misc. We need to buy a child stall. <laughs> I know. It's not what we came for. But. Um, let's see. Focus. Focus. Uh, we need... Goat horns. Always grab goat horns when you see them, because sometimes they can be really hard to find. Uh, he has refined moonstone, but I need quicksilver. It says lockpicks. Lockpicks. Always buy the lockpicks, <laughs> because... I am bad at picking locks. Um, all right, he does not have what I need. Oh, uh, oh. All right then. Yeah, I was going to sell more things, but he does not have money to buy them. So the Riverwood Trader is everything. Elsewhere. Hey, is the blacksmith back? No. Hello? I need to buy your wares. Where are you? The, uh... Calvorium. Damn Stormcloak rebels. You're pretty. I'll give you that. Just stay away from my husband, Alvar. Can't wait to kill another of Ulfric's boys. There you are. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Um, I need you to sell me things. Aye. Come Stay out. out. Keep something? an eye out for trouble. It's okay. only a matter of time. Maybe I get him to leave? No? Uh. Fuck. Dude, come on, do your job. Slacker? Okay, I guess. <laughs> well, we're going to White Run. <laughs> Maybe War Maidens is a little bit more uh, forthcoming with goods. 
And Bellather is always good for some bucks. Watch what you're doing. What? Isn't anywhere near you. We've got small weapons as well. Look, mm. I just want to buy Blades, stuff. helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Misk. What have we got? Silver ore. He's got moonstone ore. He's got iron ingots. So we'll buy some of those. Um, does not have gold or silver. Hmm. Okay. Good doing business with you. Good doing business with you. I've been walking around without a uh, companion for a while. I'm wondering if that's a good idea. I wonder if these guys have ingots. We haven't been to the Drunken Huntsman yet. Hey, uh, Eldrin. Ah, hello, my Nord friend. In the market for some hunting supplies? Not exactly. Bows and arrows for the mighty huntsman. Uh, misc. Lockpick. <laughs> Alright. Thank you very much for your business. Ah, uh, you're very welcome. My god. Why can I not stay in first person perspective? I work for Bellathor at the General Goods Store. Good for you. Great to see Bellathor at the General Goods Store. Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. Everything's for sale, my friend. Don't Some may call this me. junk. <laughs> me, I call them treasures. All right. First off, let's sell things. Um, let's see. The Winston Circlet Copper and Sapphire Circlet. Uh, uh, necromancer robes. At least one novice hood. Oh. Kind of want to hang on to these. Just in case. Hang on to the rings. Uh. We've got the Minor Conjuration and Illusion robes, we can sell those. Two sets of Minor- we'll sell the Minor Restoration with the skull on it, that's for sure. Instant circlet. Um, oh yeah, we have bonus, uh, we haven't learned Clairvoyance, but we've got- we know Flames. So we can sell that. We know candlelight too, yeah. Sell that. Okay. Uh, let's check his misc. Uh, goat horns. Those. Do we need another grand soul gem? Don't want to be wrong about that. And I can't afford it anyways. So... Hmm. Nobody has gold. Um... Can I smelt down some gold and <laughs> make a bar? That would be nice. Nobody's got Quicksilver either. Oh. I'm so mad. Somebody had like 10 Quicksilver ore. And I only bought one. And now I can't find any. Oh. Suck. And he's got a Grand Soul Gem and I bet I'm gonna need another Grand Soul Gem. But I don't have enough money for it. Um, I'm going to make myself have enough money for it. We're gonna sell... Sell some poison. 
<laughs> sell a bunch of frostbite venom. We do not need that much. Uh, we're not using poison this round because we're not using weapons. Um, let's buy that grand soul gem. Okay. So we're broke. We are broke as a joke. But, uh... Hmm. Do come back. Alright. We're going to Golden Hills. <laughs> our, our money, uh... Our money laundering, uh... Front. Let's hope, uh... Upgrade's got some cash for us so we can uh, supplement our cozy habit here. <laughs> and we may have some uh, some items stashed here. Now we may be able to make some uh, some potions to sell. Make more poisons to sell. I know we've got the stuff for that. Left through back of the house. Nope, she must be out and about already. Huh. Oh, there she is. Spider up by the house. You're someone who can get things done. I like that. Sorry to bother you on your lunch break. Want to hear a little Nord wisdom? Oh. Very good, ma'am. Okay. Well, not a lot. Good. Chat time's over. But enough. Here. Let's make some potions to, uh... To sell. That can let's see. Get six chicken eggs. A couple more tapanella. Make we can make some restore magic potions, which we really need. Restore magicka to do craft. Do, no. Yeah, keep crafting. There we go. All right. So, get restore magicka. Just restore health too. Those would be uh, real nice. There we go. Okay. Let's see. What sells for a lot of money? Ravage magicka sounds like it would be. Lingering damage magicka. Cool. Of course I'm selling people stuff that will uh that will F me up. Uh just poison. Honestly, that sounds like something I should probably make for myself. Fire. Again, that sounds like something I should probably uh, fortify two handed. Uh oh. Well, that probably sells for a lot of money. Craft <laughs> uh, a handful of those and sell those off. Okay. So we've done some alchemy. Speed alchemy. It. Out of my way, go! <laughs> go! Alright, let's check the chest upstairs and make sure I don't have 
what I need kicking around the house. We will do the same. Oh, we should have done the same at uh, Tundra Homestead. Uh, looks like we just have food. <laughs> food and stabs. I can leave anything in the wardrobe. No. <sighs> We've got to deck this place out, too, because it's still looking kind of shabby in places. Yeah, I dress it up. Ooh, pretty. Okay. Yep. Go to... Tundra Homestead. Visit the family. Give the girls their dolls. They're not in bed. <laughs> Don't want to wake the kids up. Oh! You're awake! Mama, you're back! Wanna play a game? Uh, not right now. Aww. <laughs> oh, she's supposed to be in bed. Mama took me to the market. There were lots of pies and cakes there. She said she'd show me how to bake one. Cool. Got something for you. You got me now. a present? Really? Yep. Have it. Oh, I only have one doll? Well, she hasn't gotten a doll Thanks. yet. Thanks. I gave her sister a doll already. Okay. Go to bed. Oh. Rockin' with the doll. Uh, let's see, let's take the deer hides because those can be turned into leather strips. Ooh, we've got dragon bones and scales that, uh, we have a gold ingot. Holy shit, we have a gold ingot. Okay. Score. Oh, we have goat hides too. I need those. Saber cat pelt. We need a snow bear pelt. I don't think we need a snow bear pelt yet. Wolf pelt. I think we need a couple. No quick silver ingots. We got silver ingots. A lot of amethyst. We got a lot of gemstones that we could probably sell. I can make jewelry that would uh, sell. It's silver. Okay. Um. I am weighed down. I'm gonna have to weigh the goat down. Okay, so that's the stuff I needed to get. We still need to find a quicksilver and get. Uh, Yelda! You to carry something. I think we're gonna go up to solitude. I think that's gonna be my best bet to find the quicksilver. Uh, take my misc. I'm gonna equip it. <laughs> Carry the goat horns, sorry. Uh, goat horns. Anything I don't want to sell. Yeah. We have maxed out on what you can carry. Carry some of the light stuff, but she is maxed out on the heavy stuff. Okay. What is she carrying? Oh, she's carrying a child stall. So. Oh, and the dresses that I was going to give the girls. So take those back. Um. 
carrying a bunch of soul gems. Refined moonstone. Okay. I'll give the girls their other presents later. Next time I see them. Didn't even say hi to the wife. Um. I know it's a game, but I feel bad waking them up. It just doesn't feel right. Um, I could go to Fog Breathe. Or I could just go to Solitude. Let's just go to Solitude. We haven't been there yet, so uh, brace for a beheading. But... Need a ride? Yes. I can take you to any of the hold capitals. Like the higher Where do you carriage. want to go? Uh, solitude. Climb and back, and we'll be off. Ordinarily, I'd I'd walk there. First time in solitude. I just want to get there. Capitals, <laughs> I'm sure you already. I'd rather do the the uh, adventures than the monotony of walking and getting lost. <laughs> if you've come to Solitude to join the Legion, speak to Ricker. If not, just keep your nose clean while you're here, or you'll end up like Rogbeer. Alrighty, duly noted. I have never joined the Imperial Legion. And I've been thinking about it because I've never done I've never done that side of the story arc. I I uh, am curious to see. They can't hurt Uncle Rogvir. Tell them he didn't do it. Positions. As far as you need to go home, go home and stay there until your mother. You right betrayed down. us. You should tell her that her Poor uncle kid. is scum that betrayed his Get high king. With it. Best she know now, Avar. Some oh, gate guard you are! Rogvir, you helped Ulfric Stormcloak escape the city after he murdered High King Tori. Do we need to watch this? By opening no. that gate for Ulfric, you betrayed the people of Solitude. Let's go shopping. <laughs> there was no murder. Ulfric Lion. challenged Tori. He beat the High King in fair combat. Such what is, is our this way. Build? Oh, this Such is, is the, the custom of Skyrim and all Nords. Let's go to bits and pieces instead. <laughs> We've got something for just about everybody in here. Give a holler if you have any questions. Thank you. Viren said you got here just before the execution. Must have been a lovely first sight. Uh, what have you got for sale? Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. I forget to get the uh, sellables from the goat. Um, what are we looking for? Looking for quicksilver. Shit. Just get goat horns. Do we want to buy more goat horns? I don't know how many goat horns we need for this house, but we're gonna wind up picking up other uh, homesteads eventually, and we'll need them for that. So, might as well. Let's see. Um. Let's Question of minor magica, yeah. Uh, we've got stuff to sell. Sell all those. Oh yeah, I was going to make jewelry. Oops. <laughs> oh well. Don't sell the gold ingot. Fool you fool. Okay, I think everything I'm carrying I want. Let's 
Come back to bits and pieces anytime. I will be back with you in just half a second. Oh, we've got an ad coming up in mere moments. Um, let's see, what else are we selling? Uh, just, just the dragon bones, I guess. Okay, we're gonna sell the dragon bones, and then we're gonna go up to. You know, you've got a certain fire in your eyes, just like my Berend. Please feel free to look around. We've got a bit of everything. Is she hitting on me? <laughs> Welcome. Look around. We've got everything you could want in life. At least, that's what Birend always tells me. Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Cute she talks about her husband so much. Okay. Okay. We can sell her some of the dragon bones. Okay. Make sure to recommend us to your associates. I will. I need you to carry the dragon bones. <laughs> I am weighed down. Okay. Here are the kids' presents to uh your twins. There's a lot of kids in here. You guys all hiding out from the execution? I thought adventurers were supposed to look. Don't make me light you on fire, kid. Hey, wanna play tag? Not particularly. Papa says I won't see Rob here anymore, but he wouldn't tell me why not. Oh, baby. Hello, I'm Gizly, but you can just call me Erica's sister. Everyone does. No, oh, jealousy is not a good look, honey. Um, I'm going to find the blacksmith. Um. We've got an ad coming up. Uh, I'm going to be lost for a few minutes, so uh, I won't. I promise I won't do anything useful uh, in the three minutes. <laughs> Stay tuned. Fresh fish. Fresh fish. Need more water too, so I may. Uh, Take a quick break. Let's Being see. old's not so bad. Daughter keeps me fed, and my working days are done. <laughs> uh... Nope, I'm going the wrong way. He is. Follow the sound of hammering, dumbass. I bet my papa could beat you up. I bet I could light you on fire. Heard uh, they're reforming the dawn god. Vampire hunters or something. Okay. We have found the blacksmith. Okay. Uh, we're going to park here. Uh, we're going to save. Because we haven't. And we've done a fair bit. Um, and I'm going to take a quick break. Um... Back in two minutes.
Welcome back. Um, we found the blacksmith, and we are going to see if he has quicksilver. Seems or at least iron ingots. There's no end to the needs of the Imperials. But what can I help you with? Uh, what have you got for sale? The finest weapons and armor. Please, please, please. God damn it. Okay, where the hell do I get Quicksilver? I found it once, and I will never find it again. Holy shit. Ugh. Did we mine Quicksilver before? I think I remember too, because... Hmm. Hmm. Return any time you need arms or armor. My forge never rests. Wait, is Quicksilver like an alchemist thing, maybe? Maybe... Let's check the alchemists. A bit of a standoff going here. New in town, right? So if you need a place to sleep, head over to the Winking Skeever. They keep a fine inn. I thank you. Oh, this is a sad story. Oh, there's nobody here. <laughs> Hello? Hello? There you are. Just trying to read it. There you go. Cats of Skyrim? <laughs> Just gonna read your books. You're not gonna, like, actually sell me anything. Hi. <laughs> Welcome to you. You're a traveler, correct? Have you been to Whiterun? Frequently. Wonderful. I hadn't really hoped to run into someone who'd been there. My daughter, Fura, was assigned to Whiterun after she joined the Imperial Army. I was hoping you might have met her. I haven't heard from her lately. I've tried talking to Captain Aldous, but he hasn't been any help. That's usually not a good sign. Um, I'll try and get more information. Oh, that's very sweet of you. Anything you can find out from Captain Aldous would be welcome news. Uh, what have you got for sale? So you're interested in my potions and ingredients? Very much. Uh, mm, she doesn't have misc, she just says ingredients. It's an ingredient. She has salt. Does she have anything that's really hard to find? Uh, nothing we need. Just store a magic potion recipe. Yeah. Um. Don't forget me next time you need herbs and potions. Will not. Okay, so, well, that was a thought. But it was a wrong thought. Hmm. Okay. So, solitude. Strikes out. Where can we get Quicksilver? I'm gonna try Riverwood one more time because we just couldn't get the, uh, the frickin' blacksmith to sell us anything. Maybe his wife's instructed him not to talk to us? I don't know. Oh, hell. Disrespect the law and you disrespect me. I do disrespect you. And there he goes. God damn. Damn it. Ah.
Let's stay with my brother-in-law. Oh, we're not too far off. Toby's an early riser. Kids running off. Just stake out the dude's place of business. I just saw a big shadow go overhead. Wasn't a dragon. Okay. Well. Try the Riverwood Trader again. See if he's gotten any in. And maybe by the time we come out, the frickin' blacksmith will be Thank there. Thank you. You and me. We're the... Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Misc. Dwarven metal ingots. Grand soul gem. No quicksilver. All right, then. Oh, wait, does he have money? It's so in potions. The Riverwood Trader is everything. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Oh, he does have money. Let's sell him some potions. Let's see. Magic of Poison. That's worth a lot of money. Let's sell that. Um. Oh, we just bought that. Fuck me. I was in the wrong. Oh, well. Now we have a magic poison. <laughs> uh... And it only sells back for 55. That sucks so hard. Uh, sell those. Oh, we have a lot of those. Yeah, we'll sell those. Uh, Ravage, Ma Ravage Magic only does four. It's only worth four? Man. Potions you make sell for dick. Oh, Fortify Health sells for a decent amount. We got a lot of those. Fortify Two-Handed. Okay, those actually sell for a lot of money. So... Lasting potency. Okay. Warrior, we can sell. Skirmisher's potion, we can sell. Skuma we can sell. Um, yeah. That bolsters our Till next time. Income. That. Let's see if the blacksmith is What is with this fucking blacksmith? Oh my god. Because I'm pretty sure he's where I bought the quicksilver. And he's just not coming out of his. Don't unlock his house. Such a fucking slacker. Oh my god. Oh, there he Destruction is. Destruction magic's fine. Just don't May the gods away. watch over your battles, friend. Okay, don't interrupt him. He's walking back to his forge. Just follow him home. To your forge. Go to your forge and lean on your pole, and we will be able to buy things from you. <laughs> oh my god, Alvor. Why are you like this? Okay. Let him interact with his environment. There we go. He's at work. Whatever you need. 
take a look. I need to buy things. Moonstone, sort of, oh mm, my god. I get iron. Where the hell did I get Quicksilver ore? I... Why can't I get it now? I am so mad. Okay. You know what? We have the internet. <laughs> Quick silver ingot guy ring. Where the fuck do you find them? Use to craft and improve locations. Uh, silver ore vein in Lost Echo Cave. Okay, there's a quicksilver ore vein uh, near uh, the Battleborn farm. Looks like you have to. It, along with smelting, they can be bought at general goods merchants and blacksmiths. No, they can't. I cannot find them anywhere. This is maddening. Okay, we're going mining. We're going from the Battleborn farm head northwest towards Dragon's Reach. Okay. Map. There's your farm, Battleborn farm. Okay, I remember finding this Quicksilver vein. Once before, you can find a single Quicksilver ore vein. It's among some rocks to the right of an old battlement set in the hillside. Okay. set in the hillside. Is it somewhere around here? There we go. So our vein is depleted. Hopefully we have enough to do what we have to do. Let's save. Oh shit! I thought I saw a dragon. Which means we can't fast travel. Right over my kids. Oh, fuck you, pal. You better run. Okay. Dragon is taking off. Hi, girls. Bye, girls. <laughs> okay. Oh, it was right across the street from my house. <laughs> of all things. Okay. Let us... Fast travel to... Our house. There we go. Okay. Well, that was a load of crap. Um... I always try to find stuff before I, uh... Before I go cheating. <laughs> but... That was getting out of hand. We just needed to make that happen.
We need, we need some uh, some sconces down here because it's dark. Kind of creepy. Use the smelter. Do some smelting. Quicksilver ingot. Yes. Iron ingot. Sure. We're gonna need them. Okay. We have smelted. Now, before we get distracted and do something else, let's get our materials. And I see a man about an alchemy lab. Oh wait, no, we built the alchemy lab. Enchanter. Long life to you, Thane. Long life to you, Lid. Misk. Arcane Enchanter. What are we missing now? Refined moon. We didn't need Quicksilver. We needed Refined Moonstone. Which we've had a long time. Literacy is the most important thing. Oh my god. I am so sorry, you guys. I am so I'm I am glad I bought the Grand Soul Gem. Because we do need one. We only need one, we have two now. Um Oh, I could cry. I could cry. We wasted so much time and money. And, okay. Now we have an arcane enchanter. I'm not even gonna frickin' enchant anything. <laughs> you know? I'm not even gonna frickin' enchant anything. Okay, we need iron fittings. You know what we're gonna do? We are going to build the anvil up on the second floor that you can build here. Just because it makes it so much easier when you're crafting for the house. Okay, this is this is the storage room. And it's nice to have stuff here. Okay, we need iron fittings. So let's make some iron fittings. Right. Okay. Let's do some work in the alchemy lab. Because it needs the most work. Let's see. It's hanging racks. Uh, oops, we don't have our goat horns. Hey, Hilda, come here. Uh, goat hide, goat horns. You get so many goat horns. Okay. No! <laughs> <laughs> Don't light shit on fire. <laughs> Let's see. Chandelier, wall sconce, sconces, you have iron fittings. Ah. <laughs> oh, what can what can we make that doesn't involve animals? fittings. More iron fittings. Okay. You just need a lot of iron fittings. Uh, shelves can build. Uh, oh, we need more logs. Oh, 
Logs and iron fittings. Okay, so we need Lydia. Iron fittings. <laughs> We are going to be a master smith by the end of this. Bunch of iron fittings. Lydia, where are you? Oh, I think I just saw her sneak that way. Lid, mucking around in here? Yes, you are. Long life to you, Thane. Of course. Buy some building materials. What are we running short of? Uh, we are running short I'll see of to it at once. lumber. Is there anything else you need? I am so tired right now. Oh I'll see God. to it at once. Is there anything else you need? I just want to check something. Means... Very good, man. Like you to make some improvements to Certainly. the house. What did you have in mind? Okay, so she doesn't she doesn't do the furnishing for you. She just buys stuff for the house. And we will, we will equip it Until with other stuff. We will, we will expand on the house. Or the uh, staff of the house. I do want a bard. Because they're fun. Oh, shit! What just happened? Okay. A chest. A cupboard. We need hinges. Small shelf. Small shelf. Small shelf. Exterior. We need another chest. Okay, so we're gonna need locks and hinges. Small sconces. Okay. We need corundum, which is outside. Uh, hinges. Four things with hinges. More iron fittings. Probably need more nails. <laughs> smithing of 30. We are cranking on the smithing. Need corundum. It's a long walk outside. While we're walking outside, I'm gonna mine some uh, some stone. Just because I want to build the aquarium next. I want to do the basement next. There's still a lot of stuff we need to buy for the house proper. I mean, we're minimally furnished in the living quarters. Oh shoot, we have more goat horns out here. Iron ore out here. More steel ingots. Got the straw just in case. Oops, I need the soul gem fragments. Get some more stone. We need a lot of stone for the aquarium, as I recall. So we're just gonna set it, take a load off for a couple minutes. How's everyone doing? Hope you're doing well. My Monday was pretty good, apart from the whole just brain not working. stone do we have? 
53, perfect. Just what we needed. <laughs> Can you carry 53 pounds of stone? <laughs> Staggering, but at least they're not carrying 53 pounds of stone. And of course, we have to go to the other end of the house. Hey, lid. That's gone. Yeah, I've gotta get I've gotta get my followers some entertainment because this place is a drag. <laughs> okay, we need a couple locks. to look a well-stocked area. Okay. Containers. Display case and small wardrobe. Yep. Safe. Chest. Yep. It just leaves the mounted mud crab. And we're good. Okay. Lid doing a little smithing. We're gonna do the basement. So let me just check and make sure I didn't forget anything in here. I did. Chest. Uh, need more hinges. Wall sconce. Oh, we could do a we could do a mounted goat head in here. <laughs> Have a Hilda. I need leather strips and a goat hide. And leather strips. Um, I also need something else hinges. <laughs> if Hilda will let me through the fucking door. <laughs> Back at ya. Okay. Health. Ah, ah. Oh my god. Goat. Display case. Tall shelf. Mounted goat head. There we go. All right. Yep, there it is, staring right at me. <laughs> Creepy eyes. Okay. To the basement. To the basement. To the basement. No one like this room at. Cause it's good to have storage. Okay. Let's first off build some frickin' wall sconces. Child's practice on me. No, it just reminds me that my kids aren't here. Oh, we need iron fittings. Okay. We've got a sconce. Looks like it's in... Forge. Which is good because that's kind of where we're headed. Anyways. Oh, I can just use the blacksmith for from whatever angle. Um, I need iron fittings. Uh oh, we are almost out of iron ingots. <laughs> I 
That's... There's a room past here? Oh! Haha! <laughs> I ended up on the other side and got confused. Oh. I am very tired. Oh, wow. Okay. Back to lighting up the place. Let's make all the wall sconces. There we go. Um, let's look to the goat for a second. Hello. Need you to give me all that stone. Target. Fish plaques. Make the tanning rack. Mounted elk head. Sure, the hounds. Some fish plaques. Child's practice dummy. Barrels. Fish tank. Now we need all the iron fittings in the world. More nails. Let's just, let's just turn the last of our iron into iron fittings and nails. Okay, it's looking a lot, a lot homier in here. Let's smelt up a couple more iron ingots. The rest of the lighting is finished up in here. Because the basement is dark and full of terrors. <laughs> oh, and maybe we can make the base for the shrines. I think we've got the stuff for that. All sconces. We don't have this. We need clay. We don't have clay. Okay. Oh no. My headache's coming back. Um. Let's see. Can we build? through the shelving. Grab the nails. Yeah, I don't think- oh! Do a weapon plaque. Yeah, we're at the end of what we can do without iron. Okay, so... and clay. I 
think we've got a lovely basement going here. Let's, let's take a quick basement tour. I mean, we've got some lovely shelves. We've got this space for the uh, shrine. But we, we can totally build the shrine. The shrine uh, base. We've got our lovely forge here. Fully equipped. As fine as any you will find in Skyrim. We've got the walkway into what will be the aquarium. We've got a large fish tank. Do we have... We do not have large fish to put in the fish tank yet. Yeah, this will eventually be an aquarium. It's very cool once it's all filled out. If you haven't seen it, it is. It is one of my favorite features. Okay. You know, we didn't do a proper tour of either of the uh, towers we built. Got the kitchen here, which is fully stocked. Very colorful, very vibrant, very full of food, which is something I love in life. Um, let's let's drop off stuff so we can walk a little faster. Put stuff in the chest and take a proper tour of the house. We haven't done anything to the the antechamber here. And I am doing this in preparation for going to bed because I am wiped out. I just hit the wall. <laughs> We are we are going to uh, build. Oh heck, it's snowing. Okay, let's get some clay. That's enough clay. Um. Let's do the tour real quick. Then we'll uh, build the shrine. And all night. So we've got this little downstairs space for one of our towers. That's the enchanting tower. Back here we have the storage space for the uh, Alchemy Tower. I already showed you the kitchen. Come upstairs. We have my bedroom. We have what is hopefully a usable uh, alchemy lab. Yeah. Okay, you just have to be back a little ways from it. That's concerning. So, got it's quite pretty. Very nice alchemy lab. I don't know if those, uh... Wow. Check out the view, you guys. Holy crap, this is gorgeous. <laughs> I have not been up here yet. Oh, how pretty. 
This is lovely. And you get a great view of the Necromancer Circle. Good to know. Oh, and you can see the, uh, the other tower from here. Nice. Okay. So, spectacular view. And we've got our... Oops. Got our staff's uh, sleeping room. We've got the arcane enchant. God, that is an intimidating looking piece of equipment right there. We've got strong boxes, which is nice. Nice to have. A mannequin. Very nice. Oh, wait a second. There we go. That looks dashing. That way I won't accidentally sell it. But yeah, we've got an arcane enchanter. Got <laughs> burning browsers in the house. Great idea. Ooh, look at the aura. How pretty is that? Great view of the rest of the house. A log pile. <laughs> yeah. This is quite pretty. Oh, this has a little a little sitting area. I have a glass of wine and Ponder the view. Love it. Okay, let's go build a shrine and go to bed. <laughs> Sorry it's going to be such an early stream, but... Uh, I'm just getting old, guys. I'm just getting old. I think you just need quarried stone and clay for this. It's gonna be something else. I know it. But... I think that's all you need. Miss Shrine Base. I was right. There we go. That opens up all of the different shrines you can build. Shrine Mars easier than I thought. Oh, Stendar is super easy. <laughs> if you have Quicksilver Ink it. I thought I had a Stendar amulet. It might be back at the other house. Palace is hella easy if you, uh, Kill a lot of dragons. <laughs> Hard part's getting the uh, amulet. So eventually we will build a shrine to go on the uh, shrine stand. Maybe we'll try and collect the whole set this time. Get religious. <laughs> All right. Uh, we are going to save and stop here because I am, I am really fading fast. Um, I forgot what button I hit. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, I'm, I'm losing syllables. Yeah, I, I think, I think this is more than just me being tired. I think I'm sliding into, <laughs> back into the migraine that we were trying to break. Um, 
I will be back Friday, hopefully better rested, hopefully in better shape. <laughs> and we will play more Skyrim and maybe we'll actually do the College of Whiterun quest that we've been uh, dodging while we've been recovering from life. <laughs> so... Uh, I will see you Friday. Take care. Have a wonderful week. Um, and good night.